What is up guys, I'm back once again with another video. In today's video I'll be showing you guys my mock-up of my Tesla Powerwall. And as you can see, I have one solar panel and then two small ones. Um, we've got those going in parallel over the roof and then into my shed. So the cord comes down, goes to the side. So if we open up, you will see that will come through to my solar charge controller. So currently the battery is at 12.7 volts and then that charges the battery via this cable here. So basically I've just got that solar panel holding this. Um, we've also got another plug coming out. So this plug here will plug into this is my IMAX B6. So then I can do discharge tests and stuff like that. So plugs into this, I can charge my uh, batteries and all that kind of stuff and keep them in balance. I will show you guys my batteries. So right now I have six packs with 80 cells in parallel. So uh, yeah, it's really nice. Uh, if I just separate these, you can see this is one battery pack. It's going to be 120 amp hours, I think. So um, that's definitely going to be a lot of power. I'm probably going to need to upgrade my charger because it can only charge at 6 amp, but it cannot charge at 6 amps with a high voltage. Probably going to have to buy a few of these, put those in parallel so I can charge it like uh, what the solar panel can put out, which is like 12 amps. Um, there is another way of connecting the solar panel directly to these, but it just means they can't be balanced. Leave your comments down below on what I should do for that. But yeah, so I've got six uh, individual packs. All these cells are tested. They're really good. Most of them are 2,000 milliamp hours each, so that's nice. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, how I'm going to mount these is I'm going to try and put something on the wall. Uh, kind of like HP Powerwall. Uh, check him out, he's really good. Does similar stuff to this. Um, it's a really good channel, so go check it out if you guys haven't seen it already. So, I'm either going to mount it on this wall or obviously one of the others. But I really kind of want to mount it with a shelf maybe. That I, I can maybe have a wooden frame or something. That goes up, across, down. Then I can put a flat piece of wood on top of that. And then maybe I can have like a little uh, shelf kind of thing that these sit on or something. That they kind of mount uh, vertically. And then you've got bus bars connecting all of them together. But um, that's what I want to do for that. And then later on I want to get an inverter. So then um, I can probably mount that on the wall. Then I could somehow bring that out here and then run a big extension cord uh, towards my house so it's kind of far I guess so just out over there that will be really nice but um this is pretty much the second update on my power shed now I guess you can call it so uh, please like and subscribe if you want to um, keep keep up to date on the progress of my uh, like lithium battery pack and testing it and building it and all the updates that come along with all that and uh, yeah, please leave a like, subscribe, and uh, thanks for watching.